Hello guys and girls and welcome to your bargain bin of entertainment. Today we are playing more Super Seducer 2. Let's go. So yeah guys, most of you will already know that I've wanted to play this game for a long time. And I lost my save file of the last one, so um, hence why I'm playing through the game again now. And I cannot wait to do this. Uh, we've done the first one, Posh Totty versus Suit Model. We went with the Suit Model. And this time, we are going to be doing Boss and Secretary for the first time. If you are new here, remember to press that subscribe button if you like this kind of content. It means a great deal. We're pushing for 600 subs. Get involved. Let's go. It's dangerous territory, but the workplace is still commonplace for relationships to begin. How do you successfully navigate and avoid getting fired or sent to jail? <laughs> Goal, date your secretary. Well, we'll not be doing that. Are you sick a little bit? <laughs> a little bit, got some sinus problems. Sorry. Corona. Mm. How's your business going? It's going really well. No idea. We're what... doing uh, product design What's now. About? Really? Furniture design, oh, yes. Wow. Very excited. Got two prototypes and they seem to be really nice. Oh, Everybody brilliant. likes them. But Looks like we're already there. How many followers <laughs> you got on your honestly designed Instagram? Because that's more important than of money course. and contract. Well, that's important. Just then. one thousand at the moment, but well, I that's hope we we'll get good. more. Very good. And I'm sorry I missed your birthday. I'm just oh, yeah. the office. You know, it's a bit nuts at the moment. Bit nuts. Okay, it was really nice party. Hmm. Yes. Sorry I wasn't there, but I have no I idea what's going on. Because I've got a present for you. You do. Yeah. You ready? I think so. <laughs> what do you think the present's gonna be? <laughs> what will you get Lilia for her birthday? It's gotta be raccoon. <laughs> the start doesn't mean to go on. <laughs> it's gonna be great. Um, relax, <laughs> Let's close just your get eyes a pet raccoon. And get ready for your surprise. Alright. Mm. Okay. I thought he was in his house, not in an office. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Just get the raccoon. All right. <laughs> you ready, Lilia? Open your eyes. Open your eyes, Lilia. Open. It's a raccoon. Oh my Just God. a nice little pet raccoon. Oh, Do you want to see me, raccoon? Oh, me up, but anyway. So anyway, it's your raccoon. <laughs> it's my raccoon. Yeah, because your dad died. So I got, Tom died, right? So He did, yeah. Right, Tom died, so raccoon. now you've got a raccoon. I wonder what I have it for. What do you mean? Um, he lives about 21 years. How old is he now? Um, nine, <laughs> nine, nearly ten months. Are you oh my god! Cats are, cats are shit. Was getting a raccoon, eh? Dogs are boring. <laughs> cats are boring. Plus, I have allergy. I'm sure I'll be the only one with the raccoon. Yes, exactly. Right? <laughs> I'll be the only one. Show us your raccoon. It's a great present, obviously. Of course it is. Obviously not. Where the hell do you even buy a raccoon from? Well, don't you like animals? What's wrong with it? What's wrong with, Look, it? What's wrong with a raccoon for a birthday the present? Cuffs, if you buy someone a kitten or a puppy, let alone a raccoon. <laughs> well, let's say it's, uh, it's in the raccoon shelter. They're about to blow his brains out, right. and then you rescue it. Rescue him and send him off to the wild, not to give him as an offer. It's a present. birthday present, truly. Oh, look at that. So this is Sarah. Okay, well, it's your first day at work, so we should get you started with something. Nothing too hard. Let me ask you to... You can't focus on work because you are too busy thinking about fucking it. That's where we're going. Come on. <laughs> Sarah, we're going to have problems, you know, because <laughs> you haven't been here long, right? Not long at all. But I can't do any work because I'm just looking at you and I'm just thinking of fucking you. Jesus, guys. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. What are we going to do about it? <laughs> Can you say it one more time? Repeat myself. Yeah. All right, well, <laughs> you're very distracting, very beautiful, and I'm just sitting here fantasizing, you know, like fucking you here, fucking you there on my couch. <laughs> Everywhere. You know, when all these losers go home. Okay, th that's enough. I am sending this to everyone. Well, no, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> bam, bam, bam. You are going to be fired for Joking, that. joking. <laughs> Total joke. It's a April Fool's Day in June. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. Man. Why is that a red flag? I want to. I want to know how to stable properly sexually. That's that's what I want to learn. <laughs> so far, so good. But I've noticed one big. You problem. don't know how to stable. So we need to fix God it. God damn it! Right. Do you know what it is? No. Your stapling. Stapling. <laughs> yep. It's just not gonna cut it. So how are we gonna do this? Okay, give me a hand. 
Give me your hand. Come on, let's get this sorted. Come on. Okay, it says all in the way you touch it. <laughs> Have it a grip with your little finger here. Like that. Okay, so this is how you strip, all right? Okay, that's that. Grip it. How I went wrong all those years at school. <laughs> Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah I, I got it. it. Uh, let me try. Okay. Yeah, try. Give me a hand. <laughs> In your hand it goes. Do that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Such a bad actor, man. Ambulance. Ambulance. <laughs> Call an ambulance. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the glue. Create a situation in order to superstitiously check out her ass. That's what we're doing now. Let's do this. I'll be a bad I boss. Look, I've got <laughs> some uh, files, yeah? I just had this big pile. It was really disorganized. And if you can organize them, it would be great. So just into Organize my files, pop, please. You know, piles okay. or whatever, like, you know, the FDA stuff, the different uh, various things. So I've just put them all on the floor because there wasn't much space <laughs> on this big desk. So, oh, okay. Oops, I've just put them there on purpose just, um, there. Get in there and... <laughs> what an absolute sleaze bag. That is so weird. <laughs> I thought he was looking at his PC there. Yeah. Oh, great. Okay, um... Why would they be on the floor? Actually, they're not that important. Just uh, put them somewhere in your desk. Um, okay. Alright, thank you. <laughs> what an absolute sleaze bag. <laughs> Mr. Marina, I've got a lot of mail today. What should I do with it? <laughs> Look at that smile. It's like a golden ticket waiting to happen. <laughs> Sexual because it's your company and you can do what you want. There we go. <laughs> you know what? It's kind of the wrong question. Like, what you should do with mail? Mm, not so important. It's all what about what can you do with me? Do That's what he wants to you know. See, I'm the boss. Everything you see and everyone you see belongs to me. And here's how I run things. We're all like a family. <laughs> a family that fucks. Right? <laughs> so Weird I family. need you to be more sexual. Yeah, listen. You're opening the mail. Sexual. Oh, yeah, we're Wait all like a call. family. Mr. Larina, I've got a call for you. And I'm gonna fuck you later. Here's your call. <laughs> this kind of stuff stop is it. what okay, we need. Stop it. I'm just so imagine if you had those you conversations with people at work. Like, hello. <laughs> I like it. She's fiery. <laughs> Flirty and cheeky, they plant the seed of a relationship. A relationship. I can't even say that word today. One minute, 37 seconds later. Flirty and cheeky, to plant the seed of a relationship. It's a lot of mail, yeah? It's yeah. a lot Quite of a mail. Bit. Do you want even more yeah. mail? Yeah. <laughs> I know what you can do with it. <laughs> what? Just arrange it. You think you can do that? Just arrange yeah, it. Sure. Yeah, I bet you could. Yeah. Okay. Just on, then. dirtly arrange it. Here we go. Mr. Lorena. Yeah, what's going on? I she could have just so walked over there. For you. No, wait, wait. Hey, hey Thomas, <laughs> how you doing, buddy? <laughs> Suck them. No, 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 that's just rumors started by short sellers. You know what those guys do, Christian Thomas, Joe Price. Yeah. Uh, 3,000%. What's coming here then? No, what no, no, what no, do you reckon? The price on that drug, 2,800 and something. 820. She's intrigued. She's intrigued by the sleeves. He loves the word R and D as well. Fake news. It's fake news. Yes, yes, I understand. Another time, another time. Thank you very much, people. Bye bye, bye bye, bye. Bye bye, bye bye. Bye bye, bye bye. Bam bam bam. Sarah, get in here, please. Get in here. I had a big hotel for you both at lunchtime to make it up to you. <laughs> oh, this is so sleaze. What I want you to do is go and book a hotel for lunchtime, bang your brains out, and then maybe you'll work a little bit <laughs> bye, better bye, bye, after bye. that, okay? Alright, go book the okay. hotel and get ready. Maybe wear some sexy underwear or something. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Just go there, bang, bang, bang. <laughs> Make a cry to teach her a lesson. Do you realise what you just done? <laughs> you put through this fucking guy, Thomas Green, 
He's on the do not answer list, right? 20 people are on there. <laughs> all these shitty journalists, all trying to dig and find out stuff and publish shitty articles. So fake you news, fake through. news. To me, the CEO, do you know how uncomfortable that was for me? <laughs> it's my first week. It's gonna be your fucking last week if you carry on with this shit. Get in. Your job is easy. You answer the phone, you do some filing, you do emails. It's not rocket science. Jeez. Oh, you're crying now? Well, fuck off out of it. And if you answer the phone again and put these fuckers through, I'll cut your hand off and send you to Saudi Arabia. I'll piss off. He's a bit direct there. <laughs> I'll cut your hand off. Damn it. <laughs> Mr. Lorena. Yeah? We have three meetings coming up today. Okay. First one with the... Three FDA meetings. Guy. All right, I'm gonna need the money bag for that one. Okay, the second one with R&D manager. Oh, it's R&D okay. again, research and development. What's the next one? And the last one is with Phil Beckman. Okay, now you know I told you about Phil, right? He's very, very important. He's invested even more money. He's up to over a billion with us. So you know how he likes his coffee, he likes the little biscuit, all of that stuff. So just he likes the little you know, biscuit. Sure. Who doesn't? Tell her you had a really sexy dream about her and describe it in graphic detail. <laughs> I've got to, I've got to. I've seen you reading those magazines there. And do you know <laughs> anything about dream analysis? Yeah, I do. Yeah, like that stuff, like if you're, what is it? If your teeth fall out in your dream, then you're going to die or something yeah. like what? that. What? Well, help me with this. I, I had a true? dream last night. Mm -hmm. I was lying on the beach, eyes closed, <laughs> sun beating down, sound of the waves. Giant erection, <laughs> and then I just heard some footsteps. Side of the waves. Someone pulled down Giant my Giant erection. Then they sat on my dick, started <laughs> oh, riding, Jesus. and I heard your voice. <laughs> then I opened my eyes. Bam! There you Bam. were. What do you think that dream means? <laughs> this is so so. Disgusting. What do you think it means? Yeah, what does it mean? It means go well, fuck what yourself. Does it mean? Okay. Hmm. It's not the kind of dream There's you thought one it was. Okay. <laughs> I tell her to wear more sexy clothes to work. Uh, tell her to wear more sexy clothes to work. <laughs> You've been working here for a while now, Sarah. It's a week. And I've noticed something. It's a little bit personal, but basically these outfits you're wearing, they're not really working, okay? You they're look like working. a cross between... Hillary Clinton and that Angela Merkel German one, you know? So <laughs> the German one. We're gonna Come have on. To sort this out. I need you to take the <laughs> skirt up quite a lot. You know, I need just a little bit of arse cheek to be visible. <laughs> and oh, I don't know what to do upstairs. I mean you've got some boobs, right? Push up bra, low cut top, pum. There we go. Bam bam bam. All right? You can have some budget from the company to go shopping. What? You know what? Yeah. You have to send an official request to the HR department first. HR department? <laughs> Fuck that, it's my company. I'll tell them right now. Sarah, get HR. <laughs> HR! <laughs> Sally! Sally, get in here! <laughs> Sally, the HR one. Get her Get the someone. HR one. <laughs> Morning, Mr. Lorena. Oh, call me Richard. Okay. What's he gonna say now? Talk about a girl you fucked over the weekend with explicit detail. Yes. So how was your weekend? It was good. Yeah? You know, mine, it was hard in many ways, <laughs> right? Because first I had to do all this, um, you know, finishing the investor presentation, all that rubbish. But Saturday night, this all chick came rubbish. up, Dorothy. Oh my God, her body's amazing. God. Obviously she came to bang, so <laughs> she that came was all to as bang. usual. But get this. <laughs> She wanted it up her ass. She was so we had oh, anal. No, no, yeah. stop but do you it. Do this it? is do you disgusting. Like anal? No. Do you like? You don't like it? Maybe no. try. I'm gonna take you to court for that. All right, as long as it's after we do it. He's <laughs> gonna get the pocket vibrator out like in lesson lesson one. Ask her when the last time she had a proper scene two in the bedroom. <laughs> do you have a good weekend? Yeah, I do. Listen, I wanted to ask you. <laughs> Huh? When's the That's last time? None of your business. <laughs> well, you work for me, so I make it my business. <laughs> Everyone, I should Sarah, how long have you been working for us now? 
a couple of oh, weeks. Four, three weeks. Yeah, about three weeks, right? Look, I think you're doing great so far. You know, Thank everything's you. cool, pretty much. So when was and the last time? I just time? wanted to know, like, what are you looking for in general in your career? Like, what? how do you want to develop? Well, my main goal is to learn and develop and mm -hmm. I want to get as much knowledge as possible in all areas of the business. I'm sure you do. <laughs> Tell her that she gets an A plus for finding it and an F minus for sucking your dick. <laughs> you know, it's a bit difficult Jeez. because on one hand, you're very good. Yeah, nice telephone voice. Hello, this is Sarah. Richard and Hello. lovely, all of that stuff. Filing, A to Z, perfect. But we've got problems, you know. Conference call, mm, question from Morgan Stanley. Why aren't you there sucking my dick under the table? Excuse me? Yeah, you need to improve. Otherwise, you can be secretary forever. Tell her that the working world is really for men and that she should be focused on finding a husband. <laughs> oh Sarah, you know what? I think you're taking all this a little bit too seriously. I mean, you're a secretary. You're not really going to be more than that. Why don't you just think about your life outside, right? Like, find a man, have a little baby. Little baby Sarah, ding ding ding, you know, all ding, this ding, stuff. Ding, because bang, bang. how old are you? 22. 22. Do you have a man? No. Oh, God. I mean, you need to hurry up, find a man, get married, have babies. You're a woman, after all. <laughs> You're such a sexist pig. Oh, that right. is so Cheers. sexist. All right, well, I hope that was useful. You <laughs> dick. <laughs> Tell her she needs to set her sights lower. You're going nowhere fast. Listen, Sarah, look, we can try and do some stuff, like get you more involved, have you at meetings and whatever, but how old are you? 22. 22, she yeah. Told you, I that mean, you should be ready for the fact that you might just be a secretary, probably not mine, but someone's secretary <laughs> for the not next mine. 30, 40 years. And yeah, but we will try and get you involved and just see if you've got anything upstairs that will help you. Anything upstairs. You know. Develop. Nice way to put it. All right. Maybe. Cool. Good. <laughs> Carry on. What a great conversation. Sarah, are you there? Yes, you Richard. Can, you can see it. <laughs> Jerk off while on the phone. <laughs> Sarah, tell me, what kind of food do you like? What do you like? Food? <laughs> yeah, yeah, just tell me. Um, what a weird thing to jerk off to. I don't know. I like rice. Do you like lollipops? <laughs> do you, do no. you like lollipops? What's that sound? Nothing. Just keep talking. Tell me something else. Um, <laughs> well, I'm on speaker and with Phil Beckham at the moment. With who, sorry? Phil Beckham. Phil Beckham. Mr. Beckham again. Eh? Okay, cool. All right, catch you later, yeah? Bye. Ask her what she's wearing. You, you're in a place where there's just glass everywhere. You can see her anyway. <laughs> it's glass Sarah, everywhere. What are you right now? Um... One moment. What colour underwear? Can you check the label, Mr. Prank caller, Lorraine? Prank caller, abort. What? Prank caller, prank caller, abort. How to behave at the networking event. Play cool when there. Get drunk and make a move. Be slightly flirty. Let's get drunk and make a move. Why not? This is a little bit too oh, early, don't you think? Of course not, man. And... Exactly. Yeah. A little bit inappropriate. Of course not. One week later. <laughs> uh oh. File and order. So, you went to the event with Mr. Larina? Yeah, I did. Did anything oh, happen? Got smashed. Oh, it was a disaster. He started touching me and it was so awkward. Oh, what a creep. Yeah. <laughs> How to behave at the networking event? <laughs> Get drunk and make a move. Let's keep on going through the same this thing over and over, over early, again. Don't you think? <laughs> I'm getting drunk first. And Here we go. Okay, marketing team. Getting smashed. It's the weekly strategy meeting. I want to get it kicked off in a great way. So, who has a fantastic idea? Who has an idea? Mr. Laruna. Gerald. Alexander. Okay. I've got one. Well, that's funny. I've been the proposal. Name's Alexander on there. <laughs> Didn't listen to a word of that. <laughs> Masturbate into the plant pot. <laughs> why not? Just why not? <laughs> Do you want to know what I think of that idea, Gerald? Everyone, you want to know? Yeah? Was it a good idea? Do you want to know? All right, check it out. 
Gerald, this plant is your idea. I'll show you what I think of your fucking idea, yeah? <laughs> imagine. Uh, imagine. When you come in, it's really good at the same time. <laughs> this guy's really watching that plant pot. Get back to work. Get back to work. <laughs> <laughs> Give him a big slap and fire and there we go. Okay, Gerald. Right, the rest of you. So you want to see what happens if you bring me this kind of fucking dog shit ideas, yeah? Look what happens to Gerald and this is going to be you. Right, you cunt. You're fucking <laughs> Come on, fired. You cunt. More than that. You can fuck off, right? <laughs> oh, Take your shit. shit and get out. Five minutes. He's not moving very quick to be gone in five minutes, like. Humiliate the guy for a stupid idea. Let's just do all the bad ones because that's the point in these to do Congratulations, all the bad ones. Congratulations, Gerald. The, the fucking stupidest <laughs> idea I've ever heard in this office. You can't even see his own fucking name. Fucking marketing team. Look how many of you. I want one good idea. I get this bullshit. <laughs> Sarah, you don't need notes for this shit. Look, next person that comes <laughs> up with some fucking shit like this is fired. All right, Gerald, you think about that, all right? <laughs> Remember what happened last time, Gerald. Oh, here we go, it's the next one. Hey, morning. Morning. How are you doing? You're good, aren't you? Oh, I'm all right, I'm a little bit embarrassed, though, that um, I've got a massive wine stain on, on my shirt. <laughs> it's a disaster. Yeah. I thought it said wine stain. It wasn't exactly my fault, it was busy, <laughs> but we don't need that kind of thing, you know? Wine stains are just never, never a good look. Do you think they'll be able to get it out of the dry cleaners? Uh, yeah, okay. All sure. Right. You didn't tell anyone, did you? Like, oh, Richard's done a wine No, stain. no, no, I didn't. Of course you did. Right, cool. How was the business trip for you, apart from that? Uh, it was great. It was great to see those speeches, and thanks for the opportunity. You're welcome, mate. Say she, she needs to add me on Facebook. as a company policy. <laughs> add me on Facebook. Speaking of which, if you are on Facebook, there's a link down here. Make sure you press it. Let's go. Sarah, did you read our updated privacy policy? No. No, you didn't. Well, yeah, basically, we don't have one. So <laughs> I'm going to need uh, to add you on Facebook. It's just routine. It's just to make sure that, you know, you're kind of showing the company in the right way. You're not doing anything... You know, yeah, I'm, it wouldn't I, be appropriate. I, I so. would do that, but I don't have a Facebook account. Don't have a Facebook account? What are you, a granny? You don't have Facebook? <laughs> you, you, uh, no, Instagram? I don't. No, I don't use social media. WeChat? Good on you. Ty, what is the other one? Weibo? I don't even know what that no, is. No. That's a boomer in me coming out. <laughs> have any like, photo albums at home? Yeah, at home. <laughs> all right, bring a few of those in, that'll do. <laughs> That's all. Sarah, can you come in? Richard, do you need anything? Yeah, I just wanted to share the good news. Have you seen the Wall Street Journal today? No. Ah, oh, it's brilliant. Those short sellers got fucked. We smashed they them. Fucked. Brilliant. Really? Yeah, yeah, share price is up. Guy lost over a billion. Everyone's redeeming their funds, taking money out. There you go, man. He's in big trouble now. Everything's brilliant. Congratulations. Yeah, we need to do something to celebrate. Smack her on the ass and thank her for your support. So let's arrange a team oh, dinner, yeah? Night. Like Friday night, somewhere nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just pay everyone back. But do you know what? What? You also played your part, Bill yeah, Missy. Go. So I want to say thank you for the support. Now you need some legal support. <laughs> oh, I love it. <laughs> I love it. She's so fiery. And you're going to get sacked. Take credit and tell her to boot you a spa day. Uh, <laughs> what a spa day, why not? We squeeze these shorts so well. I say we, but actually, it's pretty much me, right? <laughs> so, we need to do something. It's pretty much uh, me, right? Why don't you book me a spa day? Like one of those five hour things with like those three girls doing the massage and the <laughs> sauna, the jacuzzi, like the full works, all right? Okay, I'll do that. Whatever the cost, is worth it. Okay. Thanks. <laughs> nice massage. Nice massage, there you go. Yeah. Everything is arranged. Oh, great. Thank you. Yeah, um, I just wanted to tell you something that I really like it when you're relaxed because you seemed really stressed lately. Ah, see? Sleazy, 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 sleazy. <laughs> yeah, I feel relaxed. I feel happy. <laughs> it's, it's that feeling like 
at the end of an erotic massage where you just jizzed everywhere. You just, <laughs> just jizzed calm. everywhere. Like zen. Everywhere. Uh, funny, funny words, Zen. You know what I mean? Never use that no, ever again. No. <laughs> no. You don't like erotic massages? No. <laughs> mm. You look a bit stressed. I'll tell you why I'm stressed. Sarah, you know what? What? <laughs> More responsibilities to her job. Let's make that F minus in Ruby, yeah? I think you're ready <laughs> for some new responsibilities. Would you agree? We've been working here a while. I don't know. All right, got something for you. Are you ready? Oh nice my gosh. Oh What's going on? Someone please help. No, no, no. Someone please help me. You're not getting out. You're not getting out of a glass office. Push her against the wall and kiss her. We've been working together a long time now, right? Yeah. It's been about yeah. five well, weeks now. Things are going pretty well. Yeah. Um, I do have some feelings for you. Right. So, what you gonna do? There we go, man. See, that's how you do it. <laughs> oh, Wanga, we've done it. We've done it, guys. <laughs> Obviously not. Yes. Oh, fire yes. Don't you like animals? What's wrong with it? First Look, time I, through, 19 out of 20 wrong. We nearly got it for hours. As always guys, thank you so much for watching these. As you know, this is not the way that I would be doing Super Seducer. This is not how I would talk to women at all. I am doing this for a laugh, but I thought I'd better put this on at the end, just so you know. And if you've enjoyed laughing with me, remember to press that subscribe button. It would mean a great deal. And remember to tick that bell as well, so you know when I'm going live, so you can watch more. I am trying to live stream more of doing gameplay and everything as well, so make sure you press that notification button so you can see more of me. I'm going to leave it there. Thanks for watching your Bargain Ben of Entertainment, and I'll see you in the next video.